My name is Stephanie Elizondo and I am a consultant with Mass Solutions. Today my son Seth Hello. and I are going to show you how to play a multiplication strategy game called Target 300. We hope you enjoy it. The goal of this game is to get as close to 300 as you can, either over or under. And we're going to be rolling a die to decide what we're multiplying by. So here are our directions. First, we're gonna decide who is player one and player two. Then player one will roll the die and we'll decide whether to multiply the number rolled by either 10, 20, 30, 40, or 50. Both players will record their multiplication sentence in the column, player one on their recording sheet. So for example, if I were to have rolled a four and I was player one, I might decide to multiply it by 20. So my multiplication sentence would be four times 20 equals 80, and I'll record that under player one. Player two then does the same thing and records their multiplication sentence as well under player two. After each of the players has had five turns, both players will add their products for all five rounds, and the winner is the player that is closest to 300, but know that the total may go over 300. So we are gonna now give it a try and play our game. So we'll have the recording sheet for you. So I've just made my own recording sheet now, uh, showing rounds one, rounds one through five, player one, player two, where we can write our equations, our total, and then we will decide who wins at the bottom. So I'm player one, I'll roll first. I rolled a six. So I think I'm going to multiply by 10. So six times 10 is 60. Player two's turn, rolled a three. Five. Or 50, sorry. 50, so three times 50 is? 150. 150, all right. So as I'm thinking about this, if I've got five rolls and I'm trying to get to 300, I wonder who's gonna get there first. I rolled another six. Hmm, I don't wanna to go too high. I think I'm still gonna multiply by 10. Multiply by 40. Multiply by 40. So 1 times 40 is 40. Hmm. I wonder who's closest to 300 now. Round 3. 4. I'm going to do 20 this time. Hmm. I wonder how much I have now. So I have 60 and 60 is 120, plus 80 more is 200. So I have 200, I'm getting close. Let's do 10. 10, so four times 10 is 40. And how much do you have so far? Well, 150 plus 40 is 190 and then 190 plus 40 is 230. So you have 230 and I have 200. Hmm, close game. Two, I'm going to do 20. So two times 20 is 40. And I already had 200, so I'm sitting at 240. I feel good about my score. Off the camera, but it was a six. Six. Let's do ten. Ten. So six times ten is sixty. How much do you have now? Well, sixty plus forty is a hundred, and then one fifty plus forty is one ninety, and a hundred plus one ninety is two ninety. Ooh, so you're really close. So I wonder what you're hoping to roll. What would be a good roll for you? A one. So a I can one? multiply it by 10. Oh, 
What would not be a good roll for you? A six. Why? Because that would be 60 at the lowest. Okay. Three. Ooh. Let's see, what did I have again? So I had 120, 200, 240. So that means that I am 60 away. I'm gonna multiply by 20. I think that gives me 300. I think so too. You think so too? Mm. 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 Uh, let's do 10. <laughs> Five times 10 is 50. All right, so let's do our totals. So 1660 is 120 plus 80 is 200. And I already know that 40 and 60 is 100. So 200 plus 100, my score is 300. Your score, let's see. I heard you say before that 60, 60 and 40 made 100. Mm -hmm. And then what's 150 plus 50? 200. So plus 200, that's already 300. And then what do we still have left? 40. This 40 plus 40. So how much do you have? 340. 340. So if we're looking at the bottom, player one was, so how far away was I from 300? Zero. Zero. Player two was how far away? 40. So 40, 40 more than 300. So who wins? You win. So player one wins. Yay. I hope you enjoyed playing Target 300 with us today. As you play at home, think about what strategies you're using that help you come close to the target. See you again next time.